Bitcoin held our crucial massive support level of the range point of control at $67,000. From that support holding, building up these higher lows within the symmetrical triangle, we're starting to see a bit of a break to the upside. Currently though, rejecting from the value area high. I'll be talking you through what this means <laughs> in terms of the context of the chart and exactly what we're looking at next in terms of predictions and trades. So I hope that you really enjoy this video. I also want to be touching upon the live trading account which I started last week. So we're one week deep on this account, currently up $200 with actually seven trades taken, seven wins, 100% win rate. So fairly nice start to the account, right? And I'll be talking you through that as well in this video, starting of course with what you're here for and that is the analysis and future trade setup. So as I talked you through, we have this triangle, we were building up these higher lows and uh, you know me by now. If you've been following along for the past few years, you know what do I look for with triangles? It is the fake out. What did I look for on this triangle? It was the fake out. So this was back on Friday and on a live stream I done for the champion. Simply put, look for the fake out to the downside, see the reaction, take the trade, trade it back up towards 69k, right? That's exactly what happened. We got the downside fake out. We got the wick low. We got the close back above. And then, of course, at this point, you're activating your long trades. Uh, and that was the low put in on the value area low. I'm even going to give you a very quick glimpse of the order flow because this is what I call order flow perfection. Couldn't have got any better than this, okay? On that fake out wick to the downside of the triangle on the value area low, you had a massive, a massive amount of 18 million trapped shorts that was a 18 million negative delta candle fairly high volume open interest increase trap shorts at the low the most perfect reaction that you could see order flow the reaction the visible candles lining up together to activate that very nice long i did take that long in the end taking it as more of a day trade uh, and we actually have now seen continuation to the upside. And I will show you really simply, where have we topped out? Where did we bottom out? The value area low. I'll give you one guess where we topped out. The value area high. Simple range rotation. Very, very simple. Value area low, fake out of the triangle. Value area high, fake out of the triangle. That's what we got going on right now. I will be very honest with you. This has a large part to play on the initial balance of the stock market. The first half of the initial balance, fairly neutral. The second half of the initial balance of New York Open, very bearish. Uh, with the stock market moving down on that initial balance, have a guess what Bitcoin done. It followed to the downside. Actually, though, just back testing the triangle high as it stands. So that is the quick few five, two minute, three minute recap of what's happened. OK, I love to give you these recaps because the context is so important to know how you're going to be trading next. OK, it's the most important part, right? You have to understand that. So you understand how we bottomed out where we did really simply off of a triangle fake out value area low. And you understand where we're topping out now. Value area high on a daily naked point of control and this local pivot here on the back test of that triangle. OK, so my analysis, I'll be honest with you, is very similar to last week. Why? Well, we're in the exact same range as last week. That's why. Uh, bigger levels. OK, we now have this triangle in play, which I'm going to talk you through, too. OK, but in terms of the bigger levels, they are for me the same. That's it. Seventy one thousand dollars, seventy three thousand dollars, all time highs. And I was always say this the same with my next important support below us, right? At $65,000, even this one at $64,000. How do I do my trades? I do my technical analysis. I recognize these levels of confluence and high importance. And then I wait with the reactions, with the alert set. I wait patiently for what? To see if I get the reaction. So just like when I took this long here, I was waiting to see do we get a close below? Then there is no reaction. So there is no long trade or do we get a wick to the downside and we trade the prediction? Well, it ended with a wick to the downside. You ended in the most perfect amount of trap shorts at the low perfection. Then you take the long trade. So it will be the same to the upside, right? Whether it's down or up next, that doesn't matter to us. We know the levels of interest. We have our alert set. We will then wait for the reaction. Let's say we make our way up to $71,000. There is no bearish reaction. We get strength through the level. Well, then we look towards our next zone to the upside, right? Those highs back on the 8th of April towards 73K. Exactly the same. No reaction. Let's go for all-time highs. So the plan above us with our levels is very similar to the levels below us. Let's see the reaction at the low. If we make our way down after the fake out, 
do we get once again some trapped longs into the sorry trapped shorts into the low with a nice reaction start of a market structure change well then we can activate some longs if we don't then we can start to look for more bearish targets which are going to be filling the all all of this triangle so let me talk you through the tr more larger triangle targets and before I get onto that, I want to mention very quickly uh, about this account. So this is just one week old. OK, so this is the account I've been running for one week now. I have really simply started this account, took uh, now eight trades. I've now uh, took another trade today, but now eight trades, eight wins, just around two hundred dollars profit on the account. A uh, hundred percent win rate. OK, uh, why did I create this account? Really simply for this. Do not trust verify okay there's a lot of people in this space the more the longer i'm in this space the more i realize wow that it is full of a lot of scammers uh and and simply put this is just what has to be done now if you want to be doing what i'm doing if you want to be trading if you want to be educating let's start to make people verify their results stop blindly trusting everybody okay uh, I'm learning this myself from people that I thought were trust <laughs> trustable. Somehow they're not actually. So, uh, you know, I just got to lead by example. Uh, this is an account that I created that I'm going to be trading on stream for the champions from a swing trading style. I want to show you the every single trade that I'm taking. I'll show you all my limit orders, all my orders, all my order history, the PNL, everything about the account. Okay, full transparency, full honesty. Uh, why? Well, there is a very, of course, large reason about the education it's all well and good be showing hey this is the trade setup this is what we're looking at but imagine being able to do that and then me showing you the exact trades that i have taken myself okay the exact trades that i'm lining you up on here you can see moon dream saying thanks for once and again another great call on pepe champion members able to make profits with me on pepe why? Because I'm out here calling Pepe. I gave limit orders preset days in advance of the exact low of this low, then on this low, you know? Um, so it's like these limit orders, these are trades I'm also taking, right? Uh, yesterday, another $44 off of the $30 we made earlier in the week on Pepe. So look, again, Pepe has been my, my biggest trader, but I do feel Bitcoin has been a bit slow. OK, I'm doing this account size in which is relatable. So I've not, you know, I've not started with a million dollars account again, right? Starting with a relatable account size and showing you it's slow and steady. You know, it's slow and steady gains. Who is going to be moaning about $200 profit a week? OK, it's it's relatable and it's achievable if you follow um you know nice strategies okay if you have that patience you can grow the accounts that's what i keep preach that's what i practice and now that's what i'm doing with this full transparency honesty uh way of just letting you see the real results you know in a in a, in a real nice transparent way so um yeah that's what i'm doing with this account if you want to file it for, follow it more uh live in real time then that's what i'm doing with my champion streams right I've actually done a stream every single day of the week last week. I done another stream this morning. I got another stream tomorrow. So I'm doing lots of streams, building up this account, trading altcoins. And uh, yeah, if you want to see more of myself doing these trades, chartchampions.com. We'll also put this out there. Uh, if you want to see me take some on YouTube, smash that like button, leave a comment down below. And if that is the case, I'll create an account for here on YouTube to do some live trading, more scope trading, okay? So you can get a bit of both worlds. Uh, final words to wrap it up here, okay? Most important, most important, okay have the plan have the levels it's not just have the levels but it's place the alerts trade the reaction that's what i love to do i will occasionally place my limit orders but i love to trade the reaction that's where you can make informed decisions from reading the order flow okay understand the importance of confluence don't forget about your futures markets they do have a confluence factor when it comes to bitcoin just as it aided the rise in my opinion today after the bullish close that we saw on friday <laughs> have a guess what the bearish new york uh, initial balance in the end also aided this down downwards move on bitcoin so very correlated markets be aware of them follow the analysis remain patient and the profits will come stop trying to become rich overnight that's not going to work take it slow take it follow the process that's all i'm going to say if you want to see my process and how i'm building my account chartchampions.com thank you ever so much hope you've enjoyed and i will see you in the very next video or if you want to see me food sooner hey i got another live stream tomorrow for the champion members cheers everybody thank you and that's me signing out goodbye